Dear students, detailed civil engineering courses like Manual Building Design, Stat Pro, ETAP, SAP, Revert, AutoCAD, Primavera, P6 are available at Civil Engineering Stavan online application app. So download the application from the Google Play Store now. Each course contains 50 plus high quality video contents and free PDFs and exercises and online certification will be provided after completing the course. Course will be available at 67 to 70% discount now and valid up to 6 months. Download Civil Engineering application now from Google Play Store or direct link is available at the description of this video. Try to utilize this offer. In this video lecture, I will explain you how to read the results after the detailing process in CSI detailing version 18 version software. Okay, so I was already done a video which is related to G plus 20 high rise building in my previous videos. So you can watch the video about the complete analysis process, modeling process and designing process by using ETAP software and detailing process also I was explained in the previous video. In this particular video, I will explain you how to read the complete results of the designing process after done with uh, CSI detailing. So and if you are not yet subscribed to our channel, please click on subscribe button and click on bell icon for more interesting updates on civil engineering topics. And if you are not yet downloaded our application, please download civil engineering by Shravan application from the Google Play Store. The direct link is available in the below description of this video. In that particular application, I was uploaded the courses like complete stat pro detail stat pro course, complete ETAPS detail course and complete SAP 2000 course and complete revert architectural software course. In the upcoming sessions, I will upload the videos related to manual calculation of the building and complete uh, research analysis uh, uh, courses as well as the complete manual calculation of the estimation and costing of the building and complete Primavera softwares, Tecla softwares, etc. Let's start our video. Now we can see we are done with the complete detailing of the building structural model by using ETAP software. So now we can see it is consisting of G plus 21 stories. Initially after the done with complete analysis process, it will show you the complete uh, detailing table on the left hand side here like this. This is the contents of the detailing. It will be consisting of components view, standard details and slab details, beam details, column details, frame details, imported views and drawing sheets. So if you want to see the complete detailing, then you can click, click on this place mark and component detailing, standard detailing. So it is showing the complete uh, list of drawing, general nodes, typical cross section of the elevation of the beam sections and A section, typical cross section of the column section and etc. Slab mat section. So firstly we have to read this particular standard detailing. So click on the list of drawing. It will be consisting of list of drawings like sheet number, sheet title etc. So you can see the complete details here. General notes, if you having any contents related to the general note, it will display here like this. Related to the compression strength and uh, uh, concrete strength and the top cover, bottom cover, concrete beam, uh, sorry, concrete beams, concrete strength and reinforcement, longitudinal reinforcement and as well as the strength of longitudinal transfers, cover, bottom cover, concrete column. This is the general notes we have to take and typical view of the beam section. Now we can see this is the drawing which is related to the typical view of the beam section. It is consisting of the zones here A, B, C, zone A, zone B, zone C as well as zone A, zone B here. So zone A is having that 0.2 times of LN distance and zone B is having at a distance of 0.25 times of LN distance and the right side also having 0.2 times of length of uh, this particular beam and 0.25 times of length of this particular beam. The center to center distance between the C zone is 0.5 meter. Okay, now we can see here. If you consider 1 meter length of the beam, then it is having the zone 1 is 0.2 meter and zone 2 is 0.25 meter and zone C is 0.5 meter. In the same way you can convert that particular section. And again it will be consisting of MS section which is related to the zone considerations like zone 1, zone 2, zone 3, zone C. Okay, so larger and smaller. In the same process it is having beam section A. Now you can see this is the depth of the beam, this is the width of the beam. This is only the component view and list of drawing standard details. Click on the elevation section. This is the elevation diagram related to the uh, particular building structural model and it will be consisting of the reinforcement and uh, etc. notations which are presented here. Okay. Typical lap length, everything is available here. Column section A. This is the column section A, section B, section C, section D, section E, section F, section G. So because of the high length of the building structural model, height of the structural model, it is having divided the height of the typical view into the section views here. Okay. So next one is mat cut in reinforcement details for this particular section. 
mat which is presented for the slab section okay and uh, now we will start with the slab detailing here slab detailing schedules and tables is important so bill of material so in the bill of material it will show you the quantities of the material like how many cages of the steel is required and how many cubic meter of the concrete is required etc for this particular uh, construction of the G plus 21 story high rise building structural model now we can see for this building structural model total area of the concrete is approximately 0 uh, 18 sorry 18,050 18,050 square meter and total volume is uh, 3,249 meters and average thickness is approximately 180 mm for the slab total bars weight in uh, W is approximately uh, 212 Point to 761 kg, 212 761 kgs, and uh, rebar area per W by A, okay, weight by area is approximately 11.76787. Rebar ratio W by V 65.48 approximately, and uh, rebar quantity for this particular project it is required for us 10 mm diameter bar, 12 mm diameter bar, 14 mm diameter bar, 16 mm diameter bar, as well as 18 mm diameter bar for that particular slab section. So for the length approximately 19,647.2 meter and weight will be in cages here like this and 12 mm diameter bar is having some length as well as the weight and in the same process 40 mm is also having 16 mm is also having length and uh, 18 mm is also having. So for construction of the all the slabs it is required this much amount of the length of the bar for 10 mm, 12 mm, 14 mm, 16 mm as well as the 18 mm. And next one is frame plants. You can see here it is having story 21 to story 1. So if you select the story 21, it will show you the framing plan at the 21 level. Okay, now you can see this is the slab which is presented at the story in 1. Rebar plan, it will load the complete reinforcement diagram which is presented here uh, as per the rebar plan considerations. And rebar plan view. Okay, now we can see this is the top rebar plan view, this is the bottom rebar plan view. Rebar plan of all bars which are presented for this particular slab section here and rebar plans of all bars which is presented at this particular location and R bars which is consisting of the reinforcement section A view, section B view, reinforcement profile view, reinforcement profile B view, bill of material again it will be consisting of slab area, concrete, this is individual slab quantities, this bill of material is complete slab details, okay, complete number of the slabs, 21 number of the slabs rebar quantities and strip previews also available if you click on the reinforcement cage view option then it will load the complete reinforcement details of diagram which is presented in that particular view option for that slab okay it will take some time for loading the uh, rebar cage view for the 21st story Now we can see this is the rebar cage view it is presented here like this which is consisting of the reinforcement diagram results everything is available here which is related to the realistic view of the rebar which is presented at the 21st story. In the same process if you select beam detailing then it will be consisting of beams framing plans so you can click on the layout of which is presented for this particular framing plan at that level having the story number layout at the 600 meters 5007 like this you can see here okay framing plan this is this is schedule and table in the schedule and table it will be showing the complete reinforcement diagrams which is presented for this particular beam section for example you can consider here 21 cb 21st story uh, beam number one cb number one okay so it is consisting of the uh, number here span number one which is having 4540 uh, 4, meter width of the beam this is the depth of the beam for this particular section it is required reinforcement of two bars at the 20 mm diameter at the top and two bars of 20 mm diameter at the top and C zone is ha doesn't having any longitudinal bars D zone is having doesn't have and it is having two bars of 25 mm diameter bar at the F section at the F section as well as the Z section okay so zone A, zone B, zone C reinforcement is also showing here like this which is consisting of 6 bars of 16 mm diameter which is having 150 mm type A bars which is required at the zone A and zone B is doesn't having any reinforcement and zone C is having reinforcement of 14 bars of 14 mm diameter which is having 150 mm reinforcement like this okay. So in the same way you will having another beam section which is related to the span 2 
having length and width and having the reinforcement values here like this in the same way it is having for the 20th story also now we can see we, i will show you the 20th story now you can see here this is the 20th story having the spans 1 2 3 4 again 20th story b 1 2 here and it will be consisting of complete table you can see here and you can read the complete results about the reinforcement values which is presented for that particular story and number of the bars which are presented on that beam section at the zone A level, zone B level as well as the zone C level, at the right hand side portion level as well as the left hand side portion level as per our consideration. Okay. So this is our bill of material. Now we can see it is liquid approximately total volume of the concrete is 3195 cubic meter and 3506. 480 kgs of the steel is required so bar ratio is available rebar quantity here now we can see bar size bar length and bar weight which is required for the construction of this particular beam sections in the same process you can select the elevation section it is having the elevation section views nothing but the rebar cage views which is presented for this building structural model high rise building of g plus 21 for example just i'm selecting 14 story it is having 14 c1 14 c1 b 14 c b3 14 c b4 14 c b5 we have already seen that particular reinforcement value in this particular 14 b section 14th story level 14th story level 14th story is nothing but this story number 14 we are having 14 reinforcement bars okay so again in the same process 14th story is having this you can see the elevation section 14 cb1 that complete diagram related to the notation of the reinforcement is available here you can see this is the 180 mm thickness 180 125 mm here you can see 14 uh, 125 mm 14 16 125 mm 18 125 mm for this level again in the same process section a if you see this section a this is the reinforcement bars which are presented at the section a section b section c section c and reinforcement profile is like this for this particular beam section so if you select another beam then it will show you the complete uh, another beam reinforcement bill of quantity is this concrete volume concrete rebar weight and rebar ratios okay rebar quantities here rebar cage view if you select the rebar cage view option then it will show you the complete reinforcement design results which is presented for the rebar cage view for the beam section okay now we can see these are the beam section at the zone a zone c as well as this is the zone c zone b and the zone a this is zone B and this is the combination of zone B and C. Now we can see this is the reinforcement diagram which is presented for the beam. In the same way, if you select any another, another beam section and another flow, it will show you the complete reinforcement diagram. For example, fifth story is there, 5 cb one is there. If you click on the cage view like that, you can see the complete reinforcement design results is available here. In the same process, if you select the column detailing, then it will show you the column plan center to center distance between the column each and every column which is presented here and uh, schedules and tables which are presented here 1 to 8 so you can see here column size is available here and column section is available reinforcement ties column section reinforcement you can see here diagrams and the floor numbers you can see here okay story number 10 9 is available here you can see 1 460 into dimension section a for this particular section it is required 16 bars of 60 mm diameter 16 bars of 60 mm diameter and 16 bars of 60 mm diameter in the same process it is showing the all the reinforcement which is presented in this table or section some of the beams are showing uh, 10 mm diameter bar for the ties okay which is having presented at 400 center to center distance for this particular members in the same way you can see the table 2 table 3 table 4 table 5 you can read the complete data here initially before drawing the uh, section views in autocad software so you can click on the bill of quantity now you can see total volume of the concrete is required this much weight is required this much rebar is required this much rebar quantities which is required for the construction of the column it is having 12 16 18 20 22 25 26 28 as well as 32 number of the bars is required here elevation view you can select and you can select any one of the elevation it is having the elevation view for that section a 1 2 3 a section this is b section bill of material section rebar quantity rebar cage view option if you click on the rebar cage view option then it will load the complete rebar cage view presented in that particular column section okay so it will take some time for loading the results which is related to the rebar cage view by using ecsi detailing version software now we can see here it was loaded complete uh, uh, rebar KGV of the column section it is having the reinforcement details here like this for the members here 
so this is the complete process of reading of the results final results and uh, extracting the data from the etabs detailing version software for project so if you have any questions regarding this particular video please try to text me your questions in the below comment box so that i will give you the answer for that particular questions in the upcoming video i will explain you video representation of the reinforcement diagrams by using etabs cfsi detailing version software thank you for watching this video and see you in the next one